everyone, it's Ashley here and I'm coming at you guys with a Christmas haul, basically showing you what I got for Christmas. In no way, shape, or form am I trying to necessarily brag about what I got because in reality, I really didn't even get that much. But I just wanted to show you guys some of the beauty products I went ahead and got and some of the items that my parents and the people I necessarily care about bought me for Christmas. So if you guys have a Christmas Day haul and you want to share it with the rest of us, then just go ahead and post it in a video response down below and keep on watching. Right, so I'm just going to jump into the first product that I got for Christmas and I was actually really surprised to see this under my tree because it is an eyeshadow palette and it's an eyeshadow palette that I've been eyeballing for an extremely long time and I was really surprised that my mom purchased this for me because I've never told her that I wanted this palette or anybody else that I wanted this palette but the palette is the Smashbox Click Your It Holiday Palette and I actually really like this because when I saw it in the store it was actually out on display and it had like the 10 shadows and then it also had like cream shadows but they're actually cream liners but I would kind of play around with it a little bit to see how they worked as cream shadows but this is the packaging it just comes in a red box and it has like indentation right here that says Smashbox Click Your It and when you open it up it has a mirror at the top which I'm going to cover up but it has the mirror and then right up here it has like the little card that show you how to do different looks and then the shadows and then a primer right here. Right here are the 10 shadows and then down here are the cream liners which is really cool because if you don't really have any cream liners it's a really good way to experiment. But that's that. The palette comes with like a mixture of shimmer shadows and then a mixture of matte shadows and then the cream liner. So I would definitely say this is a really good investment. And the next eyeshadow palette I've been also dying to get my hands on and I'm sure many of you guys here will be dying to get your hands on this as well. Just because it is sold out like everywhere. Basically just gave it away but this is the Naked 2 palette. And I absolutely love this palette. I was actually kind of skeptical on whether or not I wanted it just because so many different people said it was like identical to the Naked palette. But I mean, after I saw different reviews on it like X Sparkage and then um, Makeup by Tiffany D, um, I actually really, really this wanted the it. packaging. It comes in like a tin packaging, which I actually really like. I know a lot of people don't really like the packaging that much, but I really, really do like it just because my Naked 1 palette, the lettering is kind of like fading off just because it was like a felt um, packaging and I like this just because I know for a fact that the lettering is not going to come off so people are like what what is that the Aked palette because my end is like rubbed off but that's the packaging and it kind of like clicks when you close it so like that and I actually really like it but opening it up let me get to the shadows because I know a lot of you guys want to see it um, it comes with the big mirror right here and then these are the shadows and it comes with all those shadows right there the same as the Naked palette and then it comes with a double ended brush which I really really like. Um, I actually used it today and I actually did my eyeshadow using this palette but it comes with the double ended brush so like a blendy brush right here and then it comes with like a flat brush to apply overall shadow. Which All right, I so that's about it for the makeup products I got for Christmas, but I also got some like body washes and stuff like that. I mean, what girl doesn't like getting that for Christmas? And it came in this little bag like this. If you guys don't know, this bag is from Bath and Body, and I already knew it was inside of this bag just because I got my mother and my sister the same bag with the same items in it for Christmas, but I was actually surprised to be getting it myself just because when I I purchased these for my um, my mom and my sister I was like man I really wish I could buy some for me but it's the holidays so I'm just gonna stick with buying them things and kind of just like forget about buying myself some stuff but the scents I got was the Be Enchanted from Bath and Body Works and I actually got the body cream and this smells like amazing I can't really describe it I don't know, I'm really bad with describing scents, but it smells like awesome. And I love like the little pink and purple and like the flowers, like the detailing on the packaging just because it's like really girly and I really like it. Um, I also got the Be Enchanted Body Lotion, which looks like this. And it smells, ugh, amazing, amazing. 
and then I got the perfume and now I guess Bath and Body are coming out with like perfumes and not like the body mist but I was really like shocked to get the perfume just because these are actually $30 a box which is really really expensive um, at least for me um, I just don't buy perfume like that so I mean I got the Be Enchanted perfume which is really really cool I really really like this um, a lot and it, the smell is like to die for and then in addition to that I got another scent which is the um, shower gel but it's not in the same scent which is um, unfortunate but you can't complain I did get it for Christmas um, it is called the sweet pea shower gel and this actually smells really good so Alright, moving right along, um, this little bag is kind of like miscellaneous things that um, I got from my mother. She's so great. But it came in this little baggie. It's like Noel cool. I'm just kidding. Um, I got this bracelet from Forever 21 and which is really weird because every time I go into Forever 21 I always wanted these bracelets just because they have like an array of colors. Like they have a blue one, they have a pink one, they have an orange one, they have a green one, they have a purple one and they're really good quality. I don't feel like it's going to break on me which is really, really odd for Forever 21 jewelry but this is the bracelet and it has like gold detailing with like little um, rhinestones in it and it's navy blue which is awesome I don't have a navy blue bracelet so I was really shocked to get this and the, when I got it, I actually put it on and wore it out the same night so I'll actually put it on right now so that's it so cute all right, and then I also got a pearl bracelet, and I absolutely love pearls. Um, if anybody knows me, they say I'm like a little grandma because I always wear pearls. Like I have pearl earrings and like a pearl necklace and a pearl bracelet, but I have this, and it has a bow on it, and I absolutely love bows. And that's probably why my mom bought it for me because I have like a bow ring, and then I have like this shirt with a big bow on it, and then I have like sandals with bows on it, so... It's really, really cute. I'd probably wear this like when I'm dressing up to go out just because, I don't know, it's so cute. And then I also got this really cute pen just because um, I work at um, a place where I host. I host actually birthday parties and um, I need a pen, like a go-to pen. And my mom got me a pen that says my name on it and it's really cute. And it says Ashley because that's my name. And then it says Ashley and it has a definition of my name and it says a responsible and decisive person. So I'm responsible and decisive. Alright, so and then this is an exciting gift that I did not expect to get and it's from one of my best friends. Well, my only best friend. Her name's Livia. Hi! Alright, so um, we actually exchanged gifts this year which is really weird because I normally don't exchange gifts with my friends just because it's, I don't know, I just kind of keep it to family. I'm like, hey, I don't have that much money, can't really buy you anything. But she bought me something so I went ahead and bought her something as well. Um, she has a YouTube here so I will link her link down below. Subscribe to her, subscribe to her, she's an amazing person. Very kind hearted, very genuine. But I did not expect to get this and I was really shocked because I went to her house and then I was like, all right, I have your gift. And mind you, the gift I bought her was like in this little, little bag and then she's like, oh, your gift is over there and then my gift was like in a bag like this big. And I'm like, oh my God, why is it so big? And I felt so bad because I got her like this little gift, but I guess big things come in small packages. So um, let me get right on, I'm just kind of rambling, but this is what she bought me and it's this purse and it still kind of has like the stuff on there maybe I should take it off all right so she bought me this purse and it's from Aldo and it's like in the shape of a speedy and I absolutely love it and it was so weird because we went into Aldo to find a purse for her sister and then when I saw the bag I was like oh my god I freaking love that bag so she kind of like stole the idea that I really wanted the bag and then she like snuck and bought it for me which is actually really clever kudos kudos but this is it I absolutely love it it's so so gorgeous and I cannot wait to wear it and it comes with like a strap right here so I can kind of like elongate the purse and do all that cutesy stuff. So that's that. I'm really excited. Like, I'm in love with this bag, honestly. Maybe it's still there. Go to Aldo.com. Maybe you'll find all it. Alright, so this is one of my biggest gifts I got for Christmas, which I was really shocked to get. And it's from my mom. Hi, mom. Alright, so I'll show it right now. And it comes in like this little like black thing right here. And 
guess you guys know what it is. Maybe you don't. All right, and it's this right here. No, just kidding. All right, so it is a tablet, and it's not a Nook. It's not a Kindle. It is a Galaxy tablet from Verizon, and it's Samsung, and it's so cute. Let me turn it on. I don't think I know how. I don't think I know how. I don't think I know how. Oh, I did it! Look, okay, it's turning on. And it's so cute, I was like, oh my god, I don't have a tablet. Oh, look, it's turning on. It's turning on. Alright. Yeah. And you can download like different apps, you can download like Words with Friends, you can do like, I don't know, you can do some cool stuff with this though. So, I absolutely love this. And the crazy thing about this is that when I went to my friend's house, she had like a black like tablet sitting on her desk and I'm like, oh my god, you got a tablet for Christmas? She's like, yeah, but hers is actually a Kindle, which there's nothing wrong with and Kindle. And I told her I got it and she's like, that's so weird because everything we get is like the same. I swear, I swear to you, it's the same. We're like identical people in different bodies. But that's my tablet and I absolutely love it. I'll keep you guys posted on how that's working for me. Alright guys, so this concludes my Christmas haul. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it and I will definitely see you guys in the next video. Bye.